Micro World GX logo lesson 19A. I'm going to take two turtles and actually make them animated. We just did one with one turtle. But the question is how do you get a second turtle? If you go up here, yes, you can take your mouse and we can hatch one like we did before, but I want to show you a new command. Let me get this turtle out of the way. Let me set it back to its original turtle shape. There's a new command for you. And it makes sense. Very logical. New turtle. One word, no spaces. And you got to have quotes. Then you have to have a name. I usually use Bob. It just hatched a new turtle. Its name is Bob. The trouble is you don't see it. That's because new turtle Bob isn't, is hiding. If you show the turtle, there's Bob. Right click, open backpack. You'll notice at the top here, Bob. Right click on the other turtle, open backpack, turtle one. It'll automatically name it for you, turtle one, turtle two, etc. So we've got turtle one, turtle two. How do you talk to them? Well, do you notice that they're both pointed up? I don't want them pointed up. So I will talk to Bob, and I will tell Bob, right turn 90. Okay, it's set. Now I'm going to talk to, all one word, talk to, space, quotes, T1, and now whatever I tell it, it'll do. Right turn 90. Okay, let's say I've got uh, two turtles. One's T1, one's, T one's Bob. T1 has the horses in there. I'll uh, add some things to that. Let me click up here on the color palette the clip art and we'll change uh, we'll do some we'll do some frogs here let's see frog one frog two into the backpack and we'll go with frog three we're gonna make the turtle for Bob into something but first we have to put some backpack material in there right click backpack shapes let's say I'm going to go with the butterfly butterfly three butterfly four butterfly five okay butterfly three four and five T1 will be frog two frog three Hmm, I need this named Frog 1. Okay, Frog 5. Frog 5, Frog 2, Frog 3. Okay, I'd like them both to go. So I'll talk to Bob, and I'll make sure that the pin's up. I don't want it dragging. I'll talk to T1, put, put the pen up, make sure it doesn't drag. All right? How do you make both of them go at the same time? Well, it's basically the repeat command, and we'll do 10 of them for the fun of it. First of all, you, you talk to one of them, talk to T1, T1 has the frogs, set the shape to frog five go forward one wait one then you go back to Bob T talk to Bob set shape mm, butterfly Oop. butterfly oh what was it three forward one wait one then go back to the other one. Talk to T1. Go back to T1. It'll do it really fast, by the way, when you get going. Set shape. Frog 2. Forward 1. Wait 1. Now go back to Bob. Talk to Bob. Set shape. Butterfly. What was it? 
four, forward one, wait one. Go back to T1, talk to T1. Set the shape to frog, what was it, three. Forward one, wait one. Then go back to Bob. Talk to Bob, Oops. quotes Bob. Set shape, butterfly, five, forward one, wait one. And those of you that know this isn't going to work, no, it did work. You are going back and forth from two turtles. We'll do a hundred here. You are going to go back and forth between Bob and T1, changing them. You might like it. You might not. They're in the right direction. They're not drawing anything with the pen up, so that's good. You might want to do more than just three shapes. Some of them have five, like the elephant or some of these other horses. Let's say I'd like to go them a little faster. Well, maybe we'll make all of these point one. Instead of waiting one, maybe we will go point one. Move the turtle to get rid of that display there, point one. Point one. Point one, point one. They go a lot faster. Going back and forth between three shapes, and that's how you animate two. The question comes up, what happens if you have more? Talk about that next time.